So guys, I welcome you back for some more early gameplay of F122. All thanks to EA for lending me a code for this build. So I have one more race from this build that I have planned to show to you guys, and here's what I have in mind. So I want to try a race at Silverstone with one of the Mercedes cars. And once again, I will say this, I am still using a controller for this build because it doesn't support my TX wheel. Well, let's get the race started then. The stage is set and the curtain is rising for another Formula One Grand Prix. We're expecting close fights up and down the field today, so hold on tight, we're moments away from lights out. The 3.6 miles of Silverstone Circuit in Great Britain is hallowed ground to the Formula One faithful. We have 18 corners that wrap around this former World War II airbase and some good passing opportunities at the end of the DRS zones. So with the race not far away from starting, here's what today's grid rundown looks like. A fantastic effort from Charles Leclerc yesterday, and it's put him on pole. And a very happy Carlos Sainz will start second. Looking at the rest of today's grid, we have Hamilton, Perez, George Russell, and Verstappen, Magnussen, Bottas, Joe, and Pierre Gasly, Fernando Alonso, Mick Schumacher, Esteban Ocon and Sonoda, Norris, Ricardo, Lance Stroll and Nicholas Latifi. Vettel and Alex Albon picks up the last spot on the grid. It's almost time for the lights to go out, so let's head down to the track where preparations are underway. Anthony Davidson joins me once again in the commentary box, and it's fantastic to have you with us here, but I'm curious, as a man with experience out on the track, how do you stop those pre-race nerves from becoming overwhelming when you're lining up on the grid? Well, I imagine they'll be starting to feel the adrenaline as they anticipate the rundown into Turn 1, a bit like preparing to go into battle. The unknown situation will bring nerves, but that's a good thing. It will keep them focused on the moment and on their surroundings as we build towards the start of the Grand Prix.
a new fastest lap of the race. Gap to your teammate behind is 3.9 seconds. here at Silverstone, a memorable race and an impressive victory. I think that smart tyre management on track and very smooth driving definitely assisted in their victory today. That combination meant they got the absolute maximum out of their tyres at all times. After an excellent performance at the Grand Prix, I'm sure there'll be plenty of celebrations tonight amongst the Mercedes team, and they certainly deserve it. But there's no question in my mind, it has to go to George Russell. What a performance. He's got every right to be proud of what he accomplished out there today. Well, what an end to another fantastic weekend of racing. Thanks to everyone who joined us, and we'll see you for the next one. So yeah, there we have it, some more gameplay of the upcoming F122. Well, I'm excited for this game once it comes out because then I'll be able to try it with my wheel and also do a VR race with my wheel instead of a controller. Well guys, if you enjoyed the video, keep thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.